Hey, what's up guys? Thank you very much for joining. <clears throat> Please excuse my voice, it's uh, a little rough today, but uh, my request would to go over Born. Uh, great, great song. Um, not, a, not a ton to it, uh, but pretty, pretty fun still to play uh, acoustic solo by herself. Alright, so yeah, we're going to go ahead and go over uh, the chord, get you guys playing this song. Uh, if it's your first time here, uh, please consider subscribing, hit the bell for notifications. I do greatly appreciate it. Uh, if it's not your first time here, thank you very much again for, uh, for coming back. Uh, please continue sharing with your friends and uh, continue playing, man. I love it. It's awesome. Let's hop in. All right, guys. So um, born a little bit different to do this one on acoustic. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and play really the, the, the verse of the song and the intro bouncing back between a C and a, a C6. Uh, you pretty much kind of bounce back between that the entire time. Um, if you listen to the recording of the song, uh, they're, they're, I think, I'm not sure, I, it's probably Rick is doing, um, he's doing that. Um, so I'll, I can show you that real quick, but I don't, if you're playing by yourself, that doesn't really, doesn't really equate to much in my opinion. Um, but basically, <clears throat> kind of have a little C shape here. So um, uh, eighth fret of the B, ninth fret of the G, and 10th fret of the D. And you're just coming from the B, G, D. And then you're adding that pinky in there on the, uh, I guess the fourth beat there. Okay, so that's what they play um, if you're listening to the to the, uh, the studio version. And if you're you know if you're going to play it with a band, um, that, that's the the main the the main riff there for the verse. But what I'm playing, so we are barring playing our C here. So barring that eighth fret, uh, middle finger is on the ninth of the G, uh, pinky is on the tenth of the D, and ring is on the tip of the A. Uh, and you're going to want to hit your root note here, so that 8th fret and that low E string. Alright, so we're going to hit that. <clears throat> and we're going to focus mostly on, after we hit that root note, on our um, the D, G, and B string. Kind of leave the A out. You can hit the A, it's fine for this chord. Um, for the the C6, you're you're gonna want to just be hitting um, those three. So I kind of get in that habit there. So so for that C6, uh, keeping the bar, keep the bar, keep your middle finger the same. Uh, now your ring finger is gonna go to the tenth fret uh, of uh, of that D, and your pinky is gonna be on the tenth fret of the B. And again, you're gonna hit the G. The D, or sorry, <laughs> the G, the the D, the G, and the B string. <clears throat> uh, so, okay. And so, what I'm doing there for that rhythm piece. So, we're hitting that root note. So, root note, hitting those three strings. And then I'm doing up, up, down. So. Okay. And I'm doing the exact same thing when I go to the C6. And again, I'm always, always seeing that root note first too. So once you get <clears throat> once you used to that and you get through that to end the verse to go into the chorus. Um, so you're again you're on your C. And we're gonna end up with a C7 here. So you'll go um, root note C C7. 
and it's gonna be it's kind of, kind of a passing C7, so that leads you into your F for the chord here. So it's F back to this. Okay. And F again. To G. Back to F. And to C. Back to your verse. Okay. Um, so, <clears throat> let me get through that, uh, that verse one more time here. Or chorus, I mean, sorry. So that little uh, little lead line you can play there, which I think is pretty fun to play. Um, so off of your F, so the C here. Okay. So um, so on the high E, A fret, seventh fret, and on the B, A fret, tenth fret, A fret. And then I'll slide from the 10 to the 11. And if you listen to the song, <clears throat> if you listen to the studio version, you'll definitely hear, you'll definitely hear that piece. So then for the bridge, so you go through the verse and chorus twice, and then for the bridge, you've got um, chord progression. Love it. I love their chord progression so much. Uh, so we've got an A flat here. Um, uh, so barring, uh, barring that fourth fret there, uh, middle is on the fifth of the D, or sorry, fifth of the G. Pinky is on the sixth of the uh, D and ring is on the sixth of the A. So A flat. Then we're going to an E flat. So barring the six and eight. B flat minor, uh, barring your seventh fret, I'm sorry, barring your sixth fret, um, ring finger is on the eighth of the A and pinky is on the eighth of the D. Into an F minor, uh, barring the eighth fret here, and you've got your middle finger on the ninth of the B. Um, pinky is on the tenth of the G and ring is on the tenth of the D. With your F minor, back to your E flat. I believe they play that bridge three times. All right, so after the bridge, uh, we just have the outro left here. Um, starts on the C sharp to an A flat, E flat, C sharp. That is it for Born. Uh, again, thank you guys so much for coming back. I really do greatly appreciate it. I hope this helps you guys out. Hope you're able to bear with my voice. <laughs> Hopefully it's better by the next time. Um, but yeah, please leave me feedback, comments below, and I'll see you guys again soon.